happening now, Gwinnett County drivers are getting a rainy first test of the county's first diverging diamond interchange. The new lanes are meant to get people between I-85 and Pleasant Hill Road without creating a bottleneck. Channel 2's Carrie Cavanaugh is live with a look at how this is affecting traffic here on the first Monday. Well, Justin, right now, traffic really moving along. We were here Friday night before it opened, and traffic was really backed up to the traffic light down there. What else we're seeing right now, if we look across the street, is Gwinnett County Police. They are going to be out here for the first couple of days, today and tomorrow, making sure drivers are doing the right thing when they reach this new interchange. If we look over here, behind my shoulder, several workers here, the contractors, they are timing out the traffic lights to make sure this is going as it's supposed to and continues to move smoothly. Smoothly. Now, we drove this diamond today for the first time. We also spoke to several drivers after they got off it for the first time. And we'll share with you the common response we got when we asked drivers how they liked it. That's coming up in the next half hour of Channel 2 Action News at 6 o'clock. Live in Gwinnett County, Kerry Cavanaugh, Channel 2 Action News. More details on those divergent diamonds. This is a traffic project that's undertaken one other time in Atlanta just over a year ago today. Engineers installed a divergent diamond at I-285 in Ashford-Dunwoody. At that time, the project was projected to take 15 minutes off the morning commute.